everyone welcome back to bright mind toddlers today we are gonna learn about types of fabric and let's go learn silk silk or resham is also an animal fiber used widely in india and other asian countries silk is a natural protein fiber obtained from a protective covering called cocoon made by silkworms around itself silkworm is fed on mulberry leaves each silkworm spins along continuous threads to make a cocoon then it is boiled to make silk fiber the rearing of silkworms on large scale is called sericulture it is done for the protection of silk China, Japan and Thailand are the main producers of silk. Cotton. Cotton is obtained from cotton plant. Cotton plant is a small annual shrub. It grows in places having black soil, warm climate and plenty of rain. In India, cotton is grown in Punjab, Rajasthan, Gujarat, Madhya Pradesh, Maharashtra and Tamil Nadu. The fruit of the cotton plant is the small green ball like structure called cotton ball. It contains many seeds covering with the hair inside it. These hair are the cotton fiber. On maturing, the balls burst open. The cotton is then collected. Earlier, cotton fabric was separated by seeds by hand. It was indeed very tough. But it was very difficult to separate the fiber from the seeds by hand nowadays. Large steel combs called gins are used for this purpose. Therefore, the process of removing seeds from the mass of cotton fiber is called ginning. The ginning cotton is pressed tightly into compact bundles called bales, which are transported to factories. Cotton yarn is spun from bales. It is then woven to make cotton fabric. The fabric of the finishing is made into cloth, bed sheets, towels, rugs, etc. Wool. Wool is obtained from the hair on the body of sheep or goat. The process of removing hair from these animals are called shearing. The shearing wool is further processed to make yarn which can be either weaved or knitted to make woolen clothes like coat, sweater, muffler, etc. Woolen fiber, fibers refer a lot of air between them because of which they are fluffy. They also trap the body heat so they are good to wear in winter. Australia is the leading producer of wool followed by New Zealand and China. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe, like and share for more interesting facts like these. Bye.